Hello. In this lesson, uh, we look at um, completing table of values. Um, to complete the table of values, um, all we need to do is um, take the x values that they have given us and uh, substitute them in the rule and find the corresponding y values and then write them in the um, y um, in the row corresponding to the y values. Uh, let's look at an example. Uh, example using the rule y equal to 2x minus 1 complete the table of values below. So what x values do we have here? We have minus 2 minus 1, 0, 1, and 2. They have given these values to us. And they want us to use this rule to find the y values. All right. Um, to do that, um, we start with x equal to minus 2. So we have x equal to minus 2. All we are going to do, we are going to um, replace the x here in the root with minus 2. Remember, 2x means 2 times x. So I got to put that times back. So I write y equals 2 times x. And x here happens to be minus 2. This minus. Then write the rest of the rules. Then minus 1. Okay, now that becomes y equal to 2 times minus 2 is minus 4. And then minus 1. Minus 4 minus 1 is minus 5. So it gives us minus y equal to minus 5. So y was equal to minus 4 minus 1, which becomes minus 5. So I write it here. So we're done with the first value of x. Now we go for the second value of x. Second value of x is x equal to minus 1. Now I'm going again use the root and replace this x with minus 1. And remember again I got to put the times between 2 and x. So it becomes y equals to y equals to 2, 2 times x which is minus 1. Then the rest of the root minus 1. That gives me y equals to 2 times minus 1 is minus 1. Then another minus 1. So minus 1 take away 1 comes minus 2. So we write it here. Let's go to the next value of x. x equal to 0. Again, we write the rule with this new value for x. So y equals to 2 times x, which is 0, minus 1. So that gives me y equals, y equals, 2 times 0 is just 0, minus 1. And 0 minus 1 is minus 1. So I write minus 1 for y here. Um, next one is um, next one is uh, 1 for x. So x equal to 1. And the same procedure again. y equal to 2 times 2 times 1 
minus 1 and y is equal to 2 times 1 is 2 then minus 1 and 2 minus 1 is just 1 and the final value for x is 2 so then y equals to 2 times 2 minus 1. y equals to 2 times 2 is 4, then minus 1. And that gives us y equal to 4 minus 1, 3. So I write 3 here for my y value. Now that table of values has been completed using this rule. Uh, one thing also you need to be paying attention is uh, after you substitute it, it means that after you replace the x value with uh, the given values and uh, also added this times that doesn't show up here when you um, substitute it, you got to that put that times back and then write the rest of the rule, but also be careful with the order of operation. Um, when you're finding the y values. Here it wasn't an issue because it was just uh, times and we know that times comes first and times was first anyhow. But if my rule was something like um, if the same rule was written like this so it is the same rule I just um, change the place of minus 1 and 2x and remember there's a plus here and I put that plus, plus 2x. At the start we tend to drop the plus. So, but if you write it as second uh, term, then you got to add. Now if I'm uh, substituting here, I'm going for example to have, uh, if x is 1, I'm going to have y equal to minus 1 plus 2 times 1. Then I got to do that times first. Then go and add minus 1 to that. That is um, something that you need to be um, careful about. That is uh, all for this lesson. Thank you for your attention.